New details tonight on the push to restore an historic local landmark. We told you last week that the state pulled its funding to repair Providence's Cranston Street Armory. And today, a group of private developers toured the 100-year-old building, a requirement for anyone interested in placing a bid on the multi-million dollar renovation project. Highway News News reporter Shantae Lance has the details now from the newsroom. After nearly two years of vacancy, the Cranston Street Armory could soon be reused and restored after a tour with potential bidders. Community members and potential bidders fill the historic Cranston Street Armory parking lot. Rhode Island's Department of Administration could choose one of their restoration proposal ideas for what this Providence neighborhood calls its vacant castle. Our office is actually located about three blocks that way, and I personally live about two blocks that way, so I am very interested in seeing this project happen. Christine West is a partner at Kite Architects. Her firm is working on their proposal on how this building dating back to 1907 should be used. This building has been such a presence in the neighborhood. Um, I've lived here 10 years now, and the question is always on the neighbors' minds. What is going to happen with this building? So it's exciting to see this actually create an opportunity for something to happen. The proposal search comes after a recent halt in the state's plans to repair the building. Officials say partially because of misjudgment of cost. Department of Administration Director Allison Rogers says her goal is to choose the proposal with the best economic use. We were glad to see such a large turnout of interested uh, individuals. So uh, we are looking forward to receiving the proposals and uh, at moving forward with the project. The state's administration department is accepting proposals until the end of June. They hope to make a decision by the end of this year. Reporting in the newsroom, Shantae Lands, Eyewitness News.